I will give you all my praise. I will give you, I will give you all my praise any day, any time. All my praise. I will give you, I will give you all my praise any day. Any Hey friends, oh welcome friends. back to your own you. self. My name is Rachel. Um, welcome back to your own self where we keep it 100. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe and I'll catch you in the next one. Hey guys, um, I kind of abandoned you last week. I'm really sorry. Um, you know when life gets somehow and then yeah. This necklace is really gonna irritate me because it's not really staying on my neck. I'm gonna try and fix that. Is that better? Okay. Anyway, so I don't know what we're talking about in this in today's video. So we're all gonna find out together. Do you get what I mean? But um, I do owe you guys a mental health Mondays video, so it's probably gonna be one of those. But um. I guess I just want to encourage you guys to get out of your head and get out of your space and to know your triggers. Yeah, know your triggers. And it's very important to get out of your head as well. But know your triggers. If you know that there are particular people who um, trigger you to have anxiety or trigger you to go into a dark place, then as hard as it is, you might have to distance yourself from those types of people because when you get to a stage where you value your mental health, you will do what you need to do in order to protect it. Um, your mental health is so, I don't know, it's so precious. Mental, I don't know, mental health is like a diamond. It's, it's so precious and you can't, put a price on your mental health you 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 just i i don't know i don't know your mental health is so important and you need to do what you can in order to protect it and if that means that you can't um you know stay in your room all day or if you can't watch certain um tv shows anymore or if you can't go to certain places then that is fine it's okay it's all right and guess what you don't know anybody any explanations you don't because it's your mental health and you have to do what's best for you sometimes you just have to take a seat back and reflect okay reflect um like what causes you to enter this dark place what causes you to feel like oh i don't mean anything i'm gonna go kill myself or what what makes you feel like you're so unimportant that you don't take care of yourself you don't you don't do your daily things that you need to do you you put things off you um let go of great opportunities you you are sometimes your worst enemy your actual enemy of progress because i don't know your mind is just so important and your mental is so so important and if your mental health is incorrect it really does have an impact on your life the way you live your relationships and so many things um with me my my triggers um like sometimes um there are a couple of people there were a couple of people that i had to distance myself from because they actually were a trigger like imagine one of my friends triggered me to have a panic attack one time you know and that's not healthy at all if someone is like that in your life and they're aware of the fact that you have mental health issues and then you try to talk to them and then they're not um being caring or sensitive towards you that's not a friend that you should be hanging around with every day you know because you you like i actually you can't come and die I can't come and kill myself like it's actually true <laughs> it's true okay and if there's like i don't know like obviously i don't want you to live a life of avoidance because that's not healthy but you know what your triggers are like sometimes i will be watching one netflix something on netflix i don't know and if i watch that it's gonna trigger me to be sad about myself and so i had to stop watching certain tv shows i had to stop watching movies um so yeah um and i can't stay in my room all day every day because if i do that or if i'm bored like it's actually like 
it's not good it's not good at all like even recently i've been very bored because i finished second year and i genuinely have nothing to do with my with my life at the moment and it's been so tempting to go back to that dark place like even yesterday i just wanted to cry like i was just like like a voice in my head was just like yeah yeah <laughs> i don't want to get into it too much because i don't want anybody to like get emotional or anything like that but it even right now as i speak i feel like crying <laughs> like i can't lie to you and it's been so hard to like come on here smile give advice do what i need to do um sometimes it's hard to um go out and i don't know like sometimes i'm afraid of being alone oh my gosh please don't cry again on youtube rachel like let's get it together sis get it together oh my gosh guys one minute let me get myself together it's been so hard to um go out because obviously i'm rachel like everybody knows me as the bubbly one so if i start acting somehow people are gonna be like, are you okay are you okay and it's like yeah i'm fine i'm just sad okay i'm lonely my life is sad do you know what i mean is that what you want to hear but anyway um it's it's not always easy i mean you know you can get over it but it doesn't mean that it's it's not every day is going to be easy and like literally today i woke up and i was like today i'm just going to choose to be happy despite myself despite what is going on up in here i'm going to choose to be happy um and that's a conscious decision that everybody has to make you know um and there are days like even though my mental health is a lot better there are still days when sorry there are still days when i do have difficult days and it's like if i go out and i come back inside sometimes when i go out i'm afraid of coming back to my room because i'm so afraid of being alone yeah it's really sad i know but guys the the like just get out of your head like sometimes i just have to get out of my head spend time with people i know that spending time with people is not always as easy as it seems okay and at the same time don't push people away there are people who actually do care about you don't push them away because i feel like that's something that i do and just, just get out of your head like if if a voice comes into your mind try to say something positive to counteract it. i know it's hard guys but you have a choice and at the end of the day you're the only person that can get yourself out of this dark tunnel you're the only person that can get yourself out and i know that sounds really harsh and it sounds like insensitive but at the end of the day the only reason why i got to where i am today is because i had to make an active choice every single day to be like i choose to be happy i despite what this person does despite this situation despite university despite whatever it is despite my surroundings despite my environment i am going to be happy today i am going to have a healthy mind okay and i know it's hard but it is what it is but at the same time you have to um like obviously watching videos like this and blogs and going like seeing a counselor and all that kind of stuff is also important but i'm the one that took myself to the counseling sessions i'm the one that decided to take on counseling sessions nobody forced me you know and it's a thing whereby even though i'm the one that signed up for these counts i could have easily not shown up but if i do that i risk hurting myself and that's the same thing for you as well so um you there is light at the end of the tunnel but sometimes it does get difficult but you will overcome okay anyway um sorry it got a bit emotional but you know we're keeping it 100 <laughs> you know what i mean but anyway i hope this video was helpful and i look forward to seeing you or i hope you look forward to seeing me because i'm not going to see you you're the one that's going to see me but anyway don't forget to like share and subscribe and i'll catch you in the next one bye friends Say that your grace is all I need Oh Lord, you see the best in me Cause why call you Yahweh, Yahweh.